Man, the, the videos are just flying in, aren't they? It's crazy. I just got a lot to say this month, I guess. Today we had Feature Fragment 2. So now we have different milestones that we have to hit similar to what you would have in any other studio. So you have a couple Feature Frags, then you have Alpha, Beta, and then Gold. So right now, Nest Quest just got completely obliterated. I'm not gonna even lie. The art side of things, uh, we're, we're, we're on par, like we're doing really well. Uh, the art style is very simplistic and the textures are very simplistic, so it's more cartoony. So like, we don't really have a problem in the art side. The tech side, however, uh, ran into some issues with collision, uh, 3D collision um, for the entire city. So that was pretty difficult on their part. And the gameplay was really lacking. So today when we went into Feature Fragment 2, uh, we really just, I don't know, we, we just got... Oh, you can right now, the game has to go over an overhaul, so we can't add anything else to the game. We have to basically take what we have and uh, mold it into something that is going to be fun and playable, so um, more enjoyable. We have a week to do this, so Alpha is in a week, and if it's not put together within a week, the team will completely be dismantled, and that's really going to crush everybody's morale. The tech team, the dev side, will go all the way back to pre-production and the artists will be s uh, split up amongst the other teams that already exist in our month. I don't agree with the structure of this at all. From a very strategic standpoint, I can see why game art exists inside of Full Sail. Yes, it's giving us the opportunity to work inside of games in a pipeline um, situation. However, it really hurts the artist. On top of actually having this final project, we're also responsible to create a demo reel to get us a job when we leave here. We dedicate all our time to this final project to make sure that it, it, it takes up a large part of our, our life. So dedicating all that time to our game and trying to complete a demo reel at the same time is very stressful and very hard. This class, like this degree, does get restructured quite often. So if you guys do take game art, there's a good possibility that you will have more classes added on or taken away that will allow you more time to work on your demo reel. As of right now, it is stressful and it is hard. I mean, I'm putting in work. And you know what? Yeah, that's the way it is in the industry and the industry is a very tough industry and you'll be working nonstop during crunch time. So that's not what I'm complaining about. I'm strictly complaining that they don't give us enough time to polish or create any assets to put on demo reel for us to get a job. Let's face facts. I'm very proud of this game and I really hope it turns out really well, but this game isn't necessarily gonna get us a job because it doesn't show off our artistic ability. So outside of class, um, whatever time I can find, I'm working on my demo reel. Inside, I'm working on this final project, the Nest Quest. So hopefully, let us pray that in a week, when we go into alpha, we would have made enough project or progress and the tech will be fully functional so that we can move on to beta and we can get everything in the game that we actually want and the gameplay will be fun. That is what's going on right now. I appreciate everybody's time as far as watching my videos and uh, I will post one very soon because it seems like they're all just flowing in and it's just... It's time. So, with that being said, everybody have a great week. I don't know. I'll see you in uh, a couple days. So, peace.